So this is how to replace a Uconnect uh, radio Dodge Chrysler Jeep when your screen's melting or it has bubbles. Pretty simple, it's only six screws. It's a Phillips head. So what you want to do is you don't want to take the whole radio apart. I already took the screw out, so. Uh, make sure you don't take the whole radio apart because it will take way too much time. So after you do this, you have these little tabs you want to bend down. Keep your big hands out of the way. <laughs> there you go, thanks, sir. And then you have some over here, too. On this side, these usually will just come right off. So you want to go ahead, flip the radio now, hold it tight. Okay. If you don't hold it tight, there's these pieces, there's about like six of these between a motherboard, two motherboards, and they're hard to get in and out. So, so we have to hold the radio tight and flip it upside down? Yeah. Okay. And when you get this thing off, there's going to be one wire right here. So be careful. Just leave it like that. Don't move it. Okay. And then this thing just pops right off. Flip it over. So these are the new screens. The model number ends in SL03. The old one, you're gonna have SL01 or SL02. Those have been discontinued. They're trash. Okay. Some people, they've been selling refurbished ones. Do not buy them, they go bad. It's funny they give a five-year warranty. <laughs> That's the funniest thing ever. So you wanna connect this ribbon cable you want to make sure the ribbon cable is going to be straight. You see you actually even have like a white line right here. Mm -hmm. If it's just a little bit off, it's not going to work. It's really straight. And make sure display to display. If you take the whole thing off, video, board. Gotcha. I made that mistake before and I was like, what's going on here? Same thing. Make sure the lines are straight. It's that easy. Got it. Pop it back on. Snap it in. Make sure it's in there. And before you do that, you just want to kind of bend these back a and little you wanna, bit. You have to move the plastic before you put that bracket on because then it's going to be impossible to take it off, correct? Yeah. Alright. So you bend these back. Make sure, don't forget, flip back over, holding we'll, it tight. Hold it tight, same way, same process. And then put the screws back, and you're all done. You make this look so easy. All you need is Phillips head, hold it tight, and flip it. Uh, any <laughs> questions, uh, feel free to uh, send me a message. There's going to be a link on the bottom on where to get the touchscreens from. They're brand new, straight from LG. Um, thanks a lot.